Yo guys, Ancient Sword here. Welcome to another episode of Sirikuzai with a Divinity Impair mod for Total War Room 2. If you enjoy these videos, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and tick the bell. Alright guys, so... Yeah, let's just get this battle going. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on, because... I was attacking the docks or whatever. Alright, so... Yeah. Let's... Let's go. I'll see you guys in the battlefield. Alright, you guys. So we're here. And let's start the battle right away. And bring our guys around over here. I think they're gonna try to rush us. But they might not. Let's see what they will do. And they should have some troops going, uh, uh, coming from somewhere over here. Probably. Still not sure, but they were to our right. Uh, and hold on. We're gonna bring these guys. So they're all here. No, one more to go. Let's put this cavalry over here. Right now they're all here. Let's grab these guys. Let's send them right over here. And let's grab the cavalry and send it right here. And yes, I think they're gonna throw everything at us. Um, Yeah, they are. Let's try to go more over here because we don't know. The other guys might appear up here and they might flank us. Hopefully we'll get there on time. Alright, so our guys are going. Now hold on. These guys have arrived. So let's send these guys. Oh, we're going to use these guys to flank. Hold on. Now, nah, we're going to, because these guys are much faster, we're going to send these guys over here. And we're going to send these ones right over here. And the cavalry, we're going to send it right over here to reinforce the other cavalry. In case other units appear, we have a lot of cavalry. And there's only like four of them, I think. Alright, so... These guys, I don't think they're going to try and flank us, so let's just hold here. Just throw everything. These guys are on their way. Alright, let's pause this. Let's grab all of these guys. Put them back here. And take them off skirmish mode and let's start and let's put these guys also on a formation let's start by sending these guys over here yeah and they're coming through there so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold off over here 
And we're gonna put these guys, and these guys can also go like, uh, yeah, we're gonna face those guys. So we're, yeah, we're gonna put them right like this, and it should be fine. Where are they? Are reinforcements? At least we're gonna have like a ton of cavalry around here. Let's watch this. Grab these guys. Let's, mm, yeah, let's throw them over here. Let's wait for those guys. are gonna come right over here so yeah all right so our guys are almost there and yeah they're gonna hit these guys for sure space them out a little bit more over here guys are quite tough so we'll need to be careful with these guys we have a ton of cavalry over there though and we might send yeah we're gonna send these guys over there and we're gonna grab hold on we're gonna grab the other four these four and we're gonna send them over here like this and these guys we're gonna send them right over here you just need to be on our guard right let's attack because they're gonna throw a lot of missiles at us and let's take advantage of the fact that we have a lot of cavalry over here so let's attack with our calf Man, they're throwing a lot of stuff at us. And let's grab these guys. Send them over here. Hit these guys. One of our units has used all its ammunition. And let's get rid of these guys. And these guys right here. All 
right, let's pause this. Let's start flanking over here. Uh, actually, let's attack these guys. And let's wait with these guys. Or, yeah, let's just send them ahead. And these guys are already here. So let's send them right over here. guys like this and after these guys finish break this guy come on just throw everything Put these guys right here. Actually, actually, let's put them right here, and let's grab these guys and put them right here. All right, these guys give up. Just perfect. Let's send these guys ahead. Send these guys right here. Let's attack these guys. Let's put these guys right over here. Alright, these guys give up. Let's attack over there. And let's attack over there and take these guys out. Alright, we did it. Alright guys, I will see you in the uh, campaign map. Alright, so let's occupy. And perfect. We didn't lose a lot of men. We lost some to the Oforoi because they used their heavy infantry against them. Um, but we did pretty well, all things considered. So let's just go over here with a civil town. And let's destroy this. Yeah, we're gonna convert this into a palestry. Palestry. And over here, I think we're gonna go with some docks. Or we might go with a trading port. Yeah, we're gonna go with a trading port. That's gonna be for next turn. We're going to put these guys outside of the city. Alright, so these guys are still here. Let's put these guys outside the city. And these guys are still on their way. Yeah, we already deployed everybody, I think. 
Yeah, this one cannot move. Oh, this one can move, but we're gonna we're gonna leave her here. Yeah, and we need to take Trevorum and Octodron. So we really need these two armies that are in Medlin. So yeah. And we'll see what we'll do with these guys. But for now we'll leave them over there. So let's just yeah, let's end the turn. Oh hold on. Not yet. Yeah, let's go with unrelenting force. And now yeah. It's time to end the turn. Let's 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 accept this. lot of things all right so let's send these guys over there I don't think we're in danger over here anymore could be wrong uh yeah we have quite some money so let's go with this oh hold on we have a lot of money but we still haven't um, completed this yet and we already have uh, some docks so I don't know why why it's not going with that so what we're gonna do over here is one of these and we're gonna convert this all right now we have seven thousand to spend over here so we're gonna go with one of these we're gonna go with two of these and we're gonna convert it no we don't have money for that so hold on we're not gonna convert this one and we're gonna convert this one instead and what else can we get over here well yeah, we're gonna go with some with an aqueduct because I think we're gonna go over here with a good industry. And I don't think these guys can reach us. Uh, they can, so we're not we're not gonna leave Yulobona until we get the brave companions there. And hopefully these guys will recover some troops, but I don't think so. And then next turn we're gonna send them and we're gonna take them into Cena. 
We need to keep moving forward. So these guys, perfect. This is just, finally, these guys got here. Um, let's put these guys over here. And these guys inside the city. Perfect. Now, let's take this. It's perfect. Uh, losing 7%. Yeah, it's okay. Balance stance. All right, now I need to get rid of these guys. So we're gonna go over here. We're gonna take care of them next turn. And we're gonna leave this guy over here. And hopefully we won't get attacked by the Tulinji over here. Uh, we are gonna take Coria though, and we are gonna take Norea if we can. Let me just check something out. Yeah, we're gonna take these. We're gonna take Coria, I'll see Moenes. Yeah, we're gonna take all of those. And we're gonna need to defend Octoduron as well. We're making a lot of money though. All right, this is not bad. But it's better to go with some landed estates than this. But this is a lot better in terms of money. But it's not so good in terms of food, even though it's not bad in terms of food. While this one gives like 18 of food, which is just excellent. Uh, I usually just go with those. We'll have 35,000, uh, 3,500. We're not gonna spend any more money. And we are gonna get rid of these guys. All right, so now we should be okay. I don't think we're gonna be attacked. So we're gonna get rid of these guys. Let's just auto resolve this. Come on. All right, they're still alive, which is a bummer. Ah, oh, man. We can get there, though. danger over here they have an army over here yeah, but we're not still in danger we're still not in danger I mean uh, I don't know what we have here in terms of mercs we're gonna have to risk it we're gonna send this one over here though keep an eye on these guys and we're gonna send this one right over here because we need Vizantio not to be so bad in terms of public order. We can deploy this one. And yeah, I would love to send an army over here to Vizantio, like a defensive army. But we already have one in Medlin. The other one is gonna go to Iuliobana. And we have the money. Uh, but yeah, because we need to get these guys to the south to reform. Yeah, we need to reform these guys. And we're gonna send this one right here. And this one right here. Yeah, we're gonna start sending them south. And we might actually... Yeah, we have 4,000. Let me see how we're doing over here in terms of... We should have some Paroikoi. But they're mostly in Arbo and Toloza, I think. 
Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna actually we're gonna create an army over here. So yeah, we're gonna go with oh hold on. Which general should we choose? We're gonna go with I don't know. I do not know, but maybe tell us for us. Yeah, we actually has to be Telesphorus. So let's go with Telesphorus. Over here. I don't think we have... Oh, we have a few. Oh, yeah, because we... we uh, yeah. Alright, so let's go. Let's choose Telesphorus now. If we can find him. Telesphorus. Let's reinstate Legacy. Let's go with the wings of the Pegasus or the Daemons of Polemus. These are pretty cool. Reinstate. And yes, let's go with some Hippes. We know it's better to go with the other ones, but we do not want to spend money. Uh, so yeah. And we're going to go with few of these all right let's get one more and I think we can get one more of these yeah one more of these and that's it and then we're just gonna keep moving north and get more along the way and we're not doing so bad in terms of money actually and we are gonna reform this army these uh, these armies over here uh, and we're gonna do that in Massalia because we have a ton of Polytides over there and now let's let's do this so we're gonna send this one north check something out now we need to go over here with Agnes and we're gonna send her we're gonna keep her over here for now uh, we might actually yeah we're gonna send her right over here to check this out all right so they have nothing over there and we need to keep an eye on this army over here yeah can it reach over there no, it can't. And we can always attack it next turn. Uh, these guys can attack you, Leobona. So yeah, we really need this army uh, over there soon. And we really need more money. Alright, so let's keep this this way. Uh, we need to take Korea, and we will. We need to defend Vizontio. They don't have anything over here. And to our uh, uh, east uh, in Oburzis, uh, as long as we're not at war with the boy, we should be okay. Or boy eye or whatever, because they have like two... Yeah, they have like two eyes, the boy eye. So as long as we're not at war with them, we should be fine. And we really need to get these guys and then these guys. Next turn, we should be able to. And hopefully we're not gonna be attacked over here. I don't even know what they have over there. So I'm just gonna send, it's not a spy. Oh, there's nothing here. Excellent. Let's deploy to get some money. Uh, and now let's deploy all of these guys and level them up and whatever. Let's level these guys up. Let's go with... Let's go with military logis logistician. 
and and let's go with train swordsman and over here let's go with hmm, military logistician as well this is also good but I prefer this and let's go with military logistician again all right now let's go over here to Archimedes let's deploy the guy Damanax is right over there Artemisia let's deploy uh, we already did Philip we're moving this guy and we're gonna move him into actually yeah we're gonna move him over here and can we deploy him no all right so yeah let's end the turn and hopefully we'll do fine so yeah let's end it All right, so somebody died and hopefully it was not the leader, but I think it was. Let's go with subjugation. All right, so it was Evias. And let me just check something out. All right, so we're not doing too bad with these guys. We could be doing a little bit better but we cannot start spending money on them let's attack over here perfect all right so let's advance Let's keep these guys together. Let's try at least. And let's bring these guys north. And let's get three more of these guys. These guys right here, are they within the vicinity? No, no, they're not in the vicinities. Uh, yeah, and they can attack us, so we're not going to move yet. Vizantio is still not defended. Oh, well, let's move these guys. Where are they? Let's move this one right over here. And let's deploy him. Let's deploy this one. Send him right over there. Yeah.
All right, so these guys, I was not expecting uh, a big war with these guys. And they're probably gonna try to attack Iliobana if we leave here. We might get a bigger army over here. I don't know what kind of units they have, but they shouldn't have uh, super heavy units because I don't think that these guys are too strong in terms of their armies. And yeah, let's let's go over here with a trading port. And let's go over here with two of these. Oh, we don't have the money. Uh, we're gonna have it soon enough though. Actually, now let's not spend this money. We're gonna need the money to reform the other army. These guys, so let's just attack over here. All right, let's go with balance stands. Still not quite there. It's gonna be perfectly fine if we... Oh, but we're not gonna do that, yeah. Because if we lose more power, uh, the balance of power will be affected and we might get attacked. So it's better not to do that. So yeah, we're just gonna wait. And once we get over here, we're gonna start recruiting and getting rid of units respectively and substituting them. So yeah, and we're gonna take Coria next turn we really need to what kind of stuff do we have over here in terms of all right so we do not have many polarities or paroikoi so we should have tons of barbaroi though so these guys should be fine the kelto hellenicoi torakitai the celtic and hellenic uh kelto hellenic uh torakitai so yeah all right i think we're mostly done Oh, hold on, we need to move our spies and everything. Let's move these guys north. Let's actually, let's send her back. Uh, let's send her back for now. Let's, uh, let's, mm, let's keep Agnes here. Let's just deploy her maybe, get some, uh, some food and Let's start deploying these guys. Let's level this one up. Hmm. This will give us more money. Yeah, much better to have more money at this moment. So let's deploy. Let's go over here to Philip. We already did that, so Eridici or whatever. All right, let's do this. All right, so we're done here. So we're going to, we're going to end this turn. Yeah, oh, hold on. All right, so let's go over here with Trained Swordsman. And let's go. Uh, let's go with Military Logistician. Get a little bit more money. And let's end the turn now. It's a time when warriors must sheathe the sword and talk for the good of their people. But not yet, guys, not yet.
right, let's uh, let's refuse. Oh, man, they're gonna send a lot of armies. Let me see what kind of troops we can get over here. So we're still five turns away from getting better armies. So we're better off probably getting a few of these guys. A few Gallic Swordsmen. They're going to be useful at least. Kind of expensive though. Yeah, we're going to put these guys inside the city. And we're going to get a few Gallic Swordsmen for sure. Maybe four of them. And we're going to attack those guys over there. Yeah, we can reach them. So, so we're going to send this guy right over here. And we're going to attack with this guy. But before we do that, Actually, let's do it right away. Right? They don't want... They don't want to deal with us yet. Let's just keep our armies together. And... Let's start reforming these guys. So... Actually... Yeah, let's go over here because we need more troops around over here. More of these guys. So let's like get rid of, oh, it all depends on how many we can get. Hold on. How many of these guys can we get? Oh, but if we, we might lose the manpower. Oh, but we have like 41,000 polarities over here. So I think that losing a little bit of manpower is totally fine. So yeah, let's just uh, yeah, let's hold on. I'm making a ton of mistakes here. All right, so let's let's do it. Or we can only get two. Oh yeah, because we have yeah. All right, so let's get rid of these two. We're gonna we're gonna substitute them over here on the spot I don't know if we can do another one oh I think we can maybe another one it would be great if we could and we can maybe another one No, not another one. All right, so we can go six at a time. So, yeah. And these guys, can they move? They can. Send these guys right here. Send these ones right there. Alright, so we're very near Korea. We're gonna take it. And these guys need to be really quick. Alright, this will this will have to do for now. And these guys, I will really need to step up over here. That is for sure. We 
We might need some some cavalry over here. We're not gonna get cavalry over there for now. Because we don't have we're not making a lot of money. Yeah, we need to take Corio. We need to keep expanding. That's the only way. Uh man, I wish I was not at war with the Aseni, you know. Why did the Aseni attack us? There's no reason for them to attack. They never... Actually, I don't think they ever attacked the Romans. Uh, before the Romans attacked them. Maybe they raided some coastal villages. Uh, you know what? We might just go there and take them out. We might do that. But first we need to take this out. Alright. So, yeah. Let's just end the turn. Oh, hold on. I don't think we moved anybody. Yeah, we didn't. So, let's try to go through here now. All right. Oh, uh, let's not move Agnes. Actually, let's move her over here. And get a better view of that army. What kind of army do they have over here? All right, so this is not an easy to beat army. And let's deploy all of our dignitaries. Put this guy right here. All right, let's end the turn. Man, I really want this, but I can't, you know, because we cannot have like uh, that over there. I trust you have thought long on this. This may eventually invite great sorrow for your people. Spirits tell us that we should offer you gold. We do not argue with spirits. Oh man, this is great. Oh, we cannot accept more than that. All right, let's accept this. And let's try to go with the trade agreement as well. Oh no, they don't want that. And but let's try to go with an non-aggression pact. They also don't want that. All right, let's accept. All right, so this was perfect. Let's continue moving these guys north. We completely forgot about these guys. Uh, and, yeah. So... They have decided to back down over here. So let's try and see if these guys want peace. Oh, man, come on. Yes! Yes, they accepted it. Let's try to go with a trade agreement now. Awesome, they want a trade agreement. 
send him some payments demand some payments I mean let's go yeah let's try to get some money off of these guys man can we go with 10,000 we might no <laughs> maybe 9,000 Oh man, they don't want this. Do they want, hold on. They don't want a trade agreement anymore. Do they want a non-aggression pact? They want nothing with us. I don't know why this happened. Ah, at least we're not at war with them anymore. But we will defend this for sure. So let's keep these guys over here. We can get rid of these guys though. Because of money reasons, of course. And we're going to attack over here. And I think we're going to be attacked by them next turn. Let me see how we're doing in terms of the balance of power. All right, so they're going to attack us for sure, which is fine because they're actually at a disadvantage, even though they have these barrioses and these are pretty good units. Uh, so let's get like, in case they do not attack, let's get these, continue to siege. Let's send these guys, this gal right here. And let's deploy her, get some food. And all right, so there, we still have 5,000. All right, we need to get rid of these guys. And we will need to get rid of all of these guys as well. Unfortunately, it needs to happen. Just go. All right, so now let's see. Let's get, let's finish up with this army. Let's get two of these. And I think it's one of these. Yeah, this is it. And over here, let's go with the cheapest ones because there's not a lot of money to go. Uh, so let's go with these. And let's go with these. And we can still go, no, we can't. We cannot get a Torakitai. Man, we really need the money. I don't know what's happening to our money, you know, like we're making so much and then it just goes down too quickly. Uh, but we're gonna take Korea, so they might give us some money next turn. All right, so let's auto resolve this. We're gonna lose some troops, but actually, I don't think they stand a chance and they only have these guys so yeah we're gonna go into this battle all right guys I will see you in the battlefield all righty guys so we're here and yeah I have decided to go with this formation and let's check out these units though before anything else so we have, yeah, we have two types of uh, infantry. These are going to be, and these are actually our new uh, line infantry, which are very similar to the Romans uh, legions. So yeah, and these guys I think are the Celto-Hellenic guys. Their shields are a little bit different. 
they look quite cool as well they're not as good as the other ones but oh well at least they're cheaper and they're barbarians so they draw from the manpower of barbarians so the barbaroi or whatever so yeah let's start the battle these guys faster they're slow as well but I think they're a little faster than the um, the other guys hold on let me just put these guys together yeah I think they're all here so let's grab these guys let's put them um, right over here perfect and let's put these guys right here and let's put these two right over here and these guys actually these guys right over here Man, these guys sound serious. Numidian javelin men. <laughs> they, they sound really serious about their business. All right, so let's put these guys right here. They're not going to attack us, I think. And if they do, it's kind of not the smartest uh, option. Uh, let's put all of these guys into skirmish mode as well. I always forget about that. Alright, they're all almost there. Yeah, and these uh, Torakitai are much faster than the... At least they seem like it. Uh, than the... Um, what's the name there? Those guys, the... Uh, the... Not pikemen. Pikemen should be slow though. But the, the hoplites... So yeah, all right, they're all there. It's all there. All right, so the thing is done. Let's put this, these guys right over here. See how fast they go. Yeah, they go faster for sure. All right, so they're holding a position over there. Which, which is what I was expecting. Let's send these guys right over here. Actually, let's go right over here first. And let's speed things up. This should be an easy battle. It's just that losing like almost 20% of our troops uh, against this kind of army is not uh, good and it's actually not um, realistic we're not gonna lose so many for sure guys so let's just keep moving them forward Right, they have one unit of cavalry so we have to we're gonna be we're gonna have like two flanks exposed very soon let's continue moving forward to activate them yep they're activated pause this all right so let's put them right over here Because we're going to attack now. Alright. They're all in position. They're going to attack for sure.
All right, they're not attacking yet. Let's just throw all of our javelins. All right, let's attack with these guys. Let's let's attack with these guys. Bring them forward. Bring these guys forward as well. Bring our cav right over here. And let's bring these guys right here. And let's grab our cav. Make another battle group. Send them right over here. Hold on. Oh man, how did this happen? Oh yeah, because those guys give up. It's fine. Let's attack with one of them. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Let's send one of these guys over there. And send these guys right there. These guys are finally here attack over there let's continue sending these guys over there let's attack those guys all right let's grab our cavalry over here let's attack those These guys give up. Let's attack over there. Our general is under attack. All right, their cab is almost giving up. Attack over here. Bring these guys right here. All right, these guys give up. Attack over here. All right, they're almost giving up. And they gave up. And we didn't lose 15% of our men. We might have lost, might have lost like 5% or something. So yeah, that was good. All right, guys, I'll see you in the campaign map. All right, so this is perfect. Let's occupy. And yeah, let's see what we have here. All right, so we need the money. gonna be way cheaper to all right these this needs to go down this can be uh, transformed into a farm and this one will wait it's better to wait actually yeah we're gonna bring it down because it's gonna give us money I believe Yeah, we're gonna be attacked over there for sure. Let me just check something out. Let's try to see if we can get a trade agreement with these guys. 
Yes. Alright. They don't have much money though. But at least we'll get a trade agreement that will be valued in, uh, as four, 532. Which is great. I can sense that my God smile on us and, and let's this do an on aggression. They don't want that. Alright. Uh, hold on, hold on. Let me see who else. Man, I want that trade agreement with these guys because that's going to be very valid. That they they want nothing to do with us, but we might we might get some something going on with these guys over here. I am sure you have many pleasantries for me, but Perfect. please don't bother. Talk of meat, not honey. Perfect. Let's do this. Your offer is fair. All right, so we have two trade agreements going on. This is actually not a bad one. Uh, and let's go over here to the boy. Yeah, let's try to get the trade agreement going on with these guys. Do not attempt to sweeten truth with honey. No, they don't want anything to do with us. These boy must be very dangerous indeed. And we do not want to go into Central Europe uh, before uh, dealing with the Romans. Let's let's steal some income. Actually, we might we might be better off doing this. Right, so now we're making a little bit more money. We're not as bad as before. We're not doing as bad. So let's move this one. Uh, let's let's try to make some contact with more nations. Let's keep that one over there. Okay, this guy is done. This guy is well. All right. all right, this one. Yeah, let's deploy this one. And this one is deployed. All right. All right, guys. So I believe that was it for this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you like this kind of content. Stay sharp out there. Ancient Sword out.